Michael, we have noticed that every single team you get with, you just seem to make better. Does it benefit you being the underdog, or does it even does it inspire you to strive even more to be one of the elite? Um, you know, I don't really think about it like that. I just don't want to suck. Um, I want to run good, and so I feel like everything that we do is working towards that. You know, it's finding good people and maximizing every opportunity that we have. And I think that we've done a good job over the last few years of, of making our program better and better and better. And, uh, really, it comes down to people. A lot of teams and drivers would kill to be in the position that you guys are in right now. Are you content with where you're running right now in the year, or do you guys think you can get even better? No, I think we definitely can get better. I feel like our cars have more speed than we're showing right now. I, I honestly haven't done a good job of executing. Just too many penalties on uh, pit road and too many mistakes. I feel like we could probably be a bit better than we are. Uh, but the way that this program works now in NASCAR and the way that the championship works and, and it really comes down to winning a race, right? And so for us, the only thing that matters is getting a win. And so we're, we're definitely not content on where we're running. But we do feel like we've put ourselves in position to potentially win a race this year. Do you feel that you can be a sleeper playoff contender? Yeah, for sure. I mean, I think if you look at last year's playoffs, even though we weren't in it, we would have transferred through that first round and had a shot of transferring out of the second two as good as we are running. So, um, you know, the first part is getting that win and getting in, and I think we could surprise people once we do.